G'day fishos and welcome back to Fistix Fishing Adventures. Today we're going to pop out to Green Island, that's a little island there north of Wellington Point and I guess east of Manly and check out a bit of fishing action there. Let's see what we come across guys and don't forget to give us a like, a share and subscribe. Leave a comment, tell us what you like. So here we are travelling north out of Tingalpa Creek going through the uh, markers there at Aquatic Paradise having a bit of a cruise and just checking out Green Island there in the distance. Now the good thing about the plastics out here is you give it a good cast. Sometimes you need a dead stick it for a while, let the plastic sit in the bottom and all of a sudden, bang, you'll have a fish on. Usually it's a squire, but it's there for a good fight. So here we go, bring a little sucker on board. Unfortunately, the one on here is only a little small one, but here's another one I prepared earlier. And there we go, we let him go. Other thing you've got to be careful of when you're out here fishing sometimes if you bring your, your normal smaller estuary hooks, they can get a little bit mangled. So I've cast out, had a big hit, brought it in, you can see half the plastic's hanging off in that shot and the next shot you'll see the hook is bent so whatever grabbed it grabbed it and ran and it's gone his little buddy buddy did hang around and that's what we're going to pull in next Now the really, really great thing about these squires is even though they're small they fight above their weight. So I'll toss this guy back in and uh, have a look at a couple that I caught earlier, just a little bit bigger. Now fishing out there you don't only just get your squire and your brim and your flatties and your tuskies and that, you do tend to get a couple of sharks as well. So the other thing you'll find out there are grinners and yellowtail pike and they make great shark bait so i tend to take a uh, extra rod on board there so i can do a little bit of sharking i've just sped the footage up it is just running too slow to watch the whole fight but you can have a lot of good fun and pick yourself up a black tip a bronze whaler some reef sharks now just something to have a little bit of fun with So what I find works pretty well is you uh, get your yellowtail pike, either rip a couple of fillets off the sides and put them on some gang hooks, maybe some three gang hooks and have a wire trace maybe about half a metre long. That tends to work, so I'll do one fillet one side, fight for a while, one fillet on another side and I'll just use the frame. Same thing with the grin, I've been pretty successful doing the same thing. You can get away with using just a single, single hook there, but yeah, a wire trace around about 50 centimetres, they tend to work pretty well. So I basically uh, float that off the back of the, the, the tinny or even the kayak, uh, unweighted, and that tends to do quite well, uh, especially on that south edge there of Green Island. But just be aware, there are a few little snags out there too, so you'll start losing a little bit of tackle uh, if you're not careful. So in the future, I might uh, put myself on a big float there and just let it sit a metre or so under the water. But a fantastic fight. As you can see, you get it in close, you go to grab it, takes off again, uh, yeah, a lot of good, a lot of good fun.